were dealt one card from a standard 52 card deck. Find the probability of being dealt a queen, a club, and a diamond. The probability of being dealt a queen is just equal to the number of ways a queen can occur divided by the total number of possibilities. Now a 52 card deck would look like this. As you notice, we have 52 cards and we have four different types. We have spades, hearts, diamonds, and clubs. Each of the suit here will have a king, queen, jack, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and aces. Now notice here the total number of queens in a standard 52 card deck is equal to 4. We have 1, 2, 3, 4. One queen for each type. One queen for club, one queen for diamonds, one queen for the hearts, and one queen for spades. The total possibilities would then be equal to 52. Therefore, the probability of being dealt a queen is equal to 4 over 52, which is equal to 1 over 13 when you reduce it to its simplest form. Next, we will compute the probability of being dealt a club. The probability of being dealt a club is equal to the number of ways a club can occur divided by the total number of possibilities. Now, looking at the 52 card deck here we will count the number of clubs to find the number of ways a club can occur the total number of clubs is one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen we have 13 clubs total and the total number of possibilities will then be 13 times 4 which is 52. Therefore, the probability of being dealt a club is 13 over 52, which you can simplify as 1 fourth. Next is we find the probability of being dealt a diamond. The probability of being dealt a diamond is equal to the number of ways a diamond can occur divided by the total number of possibilities. Looking at the 52 card deck here, the number of diamonds is also equal to 13. We have 13 diamonds here. Therefore, the probability is equal to 13 over 52, which you can simplify as 1 fourth. You are dealt one card from a standard 52 card deck. Find the probability of being dealt, number one, a picture card the probability of being dealt a diamond and a spade, and the probability of being dealt a card greater than 3 and less than 7. The probability of being dealt a picture card can be computed by dividing the number of ways a picture card can occur by the total number of possibilities. The picture cards are those cards that are either jack king or queen is so if you count the number of picture cards here we have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve therefore this is equal to 12 that's the number of picture cards divided by 52 which is the total number of cards 12 over 52 can be simplified as 3 over 13. Next, let's find the probability of being dealt a diamond and a spade. This can be computed by finding the number of ways a diamond and a spade can occur divided by the total number of possibilities. Looking at the standard 52 card deck here, we can't find any card that is a diamond at the same time a spade. Therefore, the number of ways a diamond and a spade can occur is equal to zero. 
Therefore, the probability of being dealt a diamond and a spade is equal to 0 over 52, which is equal to 0. Next, we find the probability of being dealt a card greater than 3 and less than 7. You can compute this by dividing the number of ways a card greater than 3 and less than 7 can occur, divided by the total number of possibilities. Looking at the standard 52 card deck here, we can count the number of cards that are greater than 3 and less than 7. So these are the 4, 5, 6 cards. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 12 cards that are greater than 3 and less than 7. So therefore, this is equal to 12 over 52, which you can simplify as 3 over 13.